So let's start with the first section, quant section. Quant section is divided into two parts. One is quant and one is di. So we'll talk about the quant part first. And again, like CAT exam, every exam, uh, the main thing which is in the quant section is AGM. Fine. A is your arithmetic. Seven question will be based on arithmetic. Five question based on geometry, menstruation, and four question based on modern maths. So these are the three main things which you have to focus on. Yeah. So arithmetic, obviously, you see, trust me, if you're preparing for CAD, every exam, AGM stands true for all the exams going in your exam, in your paper. Fine. So out of 20 questions, just look at here, out of 20 questions, 16 questions are going to be these three areas. Remaining numbers and algebra is not very, very important, so we can ignore them. So AGM you need to complete as a first thing. The overall level of the quant section is normally high. Trust me, it's not an easy section, but obviously you will find a few easy questions. So there will be around six, seven easy questions which you can easily find out which you have to start with first. By modern maths, I mean here is permutation combination probability, which was very easy question. Trust me, three questions, and set theory one question. Maybe from logs you can expect one question. So that is what comes as part of the modern maths. Set theory, PNC probability, inequalities, function graphs. So PNC probability, set theory, and logs is three things you have to cover up for. I have to exam. Yeah. Fine. So start with the arithmetic, geometry, and modern math. These are the three main pillars of your IFT exam. 70%, 60%, 80% of the CAD of the IFT paper is these three topics. That's more than sufficient. Alright. Fine. If you want in detail, now get into the things. What arithmetic is basically they were percentages. Couple of questions, expect two questions on percentages, uh, uh, profit and loss. Mixed allegation is very very important topic again two to three questions you can expect from this topic fine time speed distance two questions and maybe time and work one question you can expect so time speed distance time and work there are four topics which are must do from uh, arithmetic point of view fine from geometry point of view circles areas volumes and triangles four topics so circles area volume and triangles area for triangle then all the theorems and everything is going to be important and uh, modern mass point of view we already talked about pnc probability set theory logs fine if you have more, more, more time number systems one or two questions algebra simple equations another two questions so they are all more than sufficient if we are prepared for cat but arithmetic geometry and modern mass these are the three must do section overall section was moderate to tough fine so right selection of the question is very very important fine another uh, all your shortcuts are going to come into picture here you are going to need all the shortcuts you have learned earlier yep so that was your overall quant section fine in your quant section there will be around 20 questions out of 20 you have to attempt 10 plus more the better but minimum 10 you have to attempt here this is going to be one area out of six were very very easy trust me a few questions were very very easy but overall six question will get from here but otherwise you have to work on the remaining part all right and time allocated for this section is total uh, 40 minutes for quant and di so probably you can pick up around 20 minutes for quant and maybe 20 minutes will be can be kept for di all right all right moving to the uh, di section there were two di sets one table was there which contained 10 questions and trust me DI is something which is very very calculation intensive in your IFT exam. If you try to touch upon all the questions trust me you won't be able to touch upon all the all, all of them because the it's too much calculation work. So what you do is within the DI 10 questions your target should be select a few questions probably 5, 6, 7 easy questions you have to pick up from that section and move on. So expect a table, long ta a small table but there will be 10 questions based on one table same like in verbal in RC as well and there will be one chart which will contain multiple charts for example there is a bar chart along with that the pie chart or a line graph with a table fine and five questions based on that yeah this is going to be overall DI section fine now again tables bar charts similarly what you have done in your CAD and other exams same preparation more than sufficient don't need to do specially for this anything special for this but this is where we digress from CAT. CAT is more of a logic based DI whereas IFT like NMAT is more calculation based DI. Yeah. So you have to tune, your, tune yourself according to that. 
so 15 question idle time 15 minutes more than sufficient time so they can spend 25 minutes on the quant section and out of 15 minutes you have to attempt 10 question that should be a target yep that's more than sufficient to clear the cutoff if there is section cutoff otherwise overall cutoff will help you clear the overall cutoff so if I summarize the overview, overview of the quant section we've got 40 minutes to do uh, 35 questions 20 in quant and 15 in di the breakup of this 40 minutes can be 25 minutes for quant and 15 minutes for di that's a perfectly all right or good breakup attempt wise in both the section you have to attempt 10 10 questions each so you can expect 20 marks attempt coming from this area in your overall cutoff all right at c taking we have launched the shortcut workshop for uh, quant verbal di logic all the areas which you can join and along with the mock so we have around five mocks for the ift exams along with the mock taking strategies and how you should approach the paper find which you can join us for the program fine then this is a complete online program you don't need to go anywhere it's a complete computer based program fine uh, all i need to work on is at least one to two hours every day to be spent on all the shortcuts and trust me that'll be more than sufficient at least you have to work on grammar sorry uh, geometry dirty quant and arithmetic from the quant point of view and rc vocab from the verbal point of view along with the uh, gk as well all right in case you have any more queries you can uh, ask me on fa facebook so facebook.com slash ravgun is my facebook page link if you want to buy the program you can uh, get more details on ctking.com all right all the best thank you